Welcome to another video. I got this new toothpaste. Waiting for the combo order for Amazon. I want to naturally brighten my smile. Right. <sighs> Lord, I need direction. So much to do in so little time. Um, the kids, I just dropped them off. I need to do something. I need to take my hair out. I just dropped the kids off. I'm wrinkled. I should iron it, but I'm happy. I need to get the spirit of laziness off of me. You know what I'm saying? I didn't wake up at five. I woke up at six. Um, didn't even get myself dressed. I did everything I had to do for kids. Came home, and now I'm doing this. Um, today is the second. Yeah. Rent is coming as due. Lord, need to help me. I need the Lord's help. And they went down on base pay on Instacart, which really upsets me. But I need to get out here and um, let the Lord bless the work of my hands because he is my best. I hate how wrinkled I am. Sorry, I don't have time. Oh, so I'm about to get out of here and get my day started and try to do as much as I can between these hours. Wish me luck. Let's go. I don't know why I battle with getting up early. I will. I know I need to go to bed earlier, but I hate how this front camera does. Let's get in the car. Oh. Why is it? The greater the struggle, the greater the reward, the greater the blessing. And I have to keep my mind stayed on that. He will not leave me. He will not forsake me. For everything I need, he will supply. But he wants me to go deeper. And it's like that feeling, oh my God, okay, Lord, help me to go deeper. Help me to get deeper in your word, deeper in your presence, deeper in worship, deeper in everything I do. You know what I'm saying? Oh my God, it's like the unknown, like, Lord, what do I do? What do I do? My God. I was at the point where I wanted to quit. I want to quit. But I hear you say so many times i just get in my own thoughts and that's what the enemy wants me to do he wants me to get in my own thoughts he wants me to see the little that i have and not focus on the much that god has for me he wants me to get distracted and get in a mind of confusion but i rebuke that and even though i don't know what i'm doing where i'm going or what the day's gonna lead i have to trust god it's scary it's scary, but it's not scary. You know, like when you're like the unknown. Oh my gosh, I'm so thankful for that song this morning. Thank you, Jesus. So let's do our part and see what kind of orders the Lord is going to give me today. Because I can do nothing without His help. Absolutely nothing. Who? All right, y'all. The Lord unblessed me. It's 10:01. Got my first order for the day. Forty dollars. It was okay, but I'm I'm grateful because thank you, Jesus. Um, it's two people, but it's only um one person has three items, the other person has like four, so it's not a lot of stuff. So thank you, Jesus, for this order. I'm gonna try to hurry and do it because I am by myself, so I can get in and out, guys. Alright, I'm done. I did that in what nine minutes? And I was trying to record, so it took me even longer. I'm in line. Shopping with the retirees. The retirees. Give me some boxes with handles and get out of here. One person has three items, another person has the other. I normally separate it, but I'm trying to get in and out as quickly as possible so I can make as much as I can before the kids get out of school. See you at the car. Have a nice day.
the first person. The first person really was only like maybe eight minutes from Costco. So thank you, Lord. Let's go to the next. Yes, come on, Jesus. Yes, Lord God. It's coming. It's coming. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Got another order. Thank you, Jesus. He is faithful. Thank you, Jesus. I'm gonna try to get this done in under 10 minutes. So this is all the stuff. I'm thinking it's an older person. Get it in 10 minutes. me with another one i'm going back i'm gonna go back to the same uh, Publix that was at this one is actually a shop and a, a shop only and a shop of the red no, don't like to do those but i am thankful for what the lord is blessing me with so i'm on my way there now i'm gonna try to do it as quickly as possible because again in the hours of eight to three you know i'm child free so i'm really so thankful that they're back in school to where I can like get in and out, in and out. Cause it T-Mobile really quickly. Something's wrong with Jermaine and I's phone. I told you guys I'm thinking about leaving T-Mobile. Um, it's like when we're calling each other, it's not going through. It's just sending straight your voicemail. I try calling my mom. And I was like, oh, I'm checking on her day. She she loved that. And um, it's, it's working fine. So come in here now to see what's going on. Just left um, T-Mobile to about 15, 20 minutes. She said it was some kind of blockage. So then she had to redo both SIM cards, but she got it working. So that's all that matters, thank God. And then she was being nosy while I was getting notifications, looking at different orders. And then I seen this one, I got a Costco. She said, oh girl, you better take that one. I said, it's not all that good, but I will take it, glory to God. So I'm gonna do that, try to hurry up. Um, they live not too far from me, but not too close to me. So I can make sure I'm to get JJ on time because right now it's like 120. So I'm gonna try to get in and out of here. Um, let's see how fast I can do it. So I got out of there kind of quickly. You know, I had to get all the samples. <laughs> all of them were pretty tasty except for one. You could check out the TikTok on that. So now I'm heading on 75 northbound to drop it off. And I'll be kind of closer to home so I can get JJ in time. And that kind of filled me up a little bit. You know how you get a, like a little hungry? That was the perfect lunch, a mixed combination. It was perfect. There was so many people in there today. And it's Wednesday at 1.40. So many people. <sighs> I just dropped that off. It was easy. She had something I brought before, the beef pot rolls. I asked her if she had it before. She said, no, it's her first time. I'm like, you're going to love it. It is amazing. I'm always telling people about food. Which way did I come? I came this way. And I put the GPS on. I'm literally going to get there in just the right time that the teacher told me, the lady in front of us told me to come pick them up. Because uh, we was there forever yesterday. And she was like, and then JJ left his water bottle. We went back. She said, oh, we'll come back after we do the pickup. And then we came back after that. Teacher's everybody was already gone for the day, child. So she said, um, 
best time to pick them pick them up is at 245 because um that's when everything dies down so if he forgets anything again i can get it immediately from the teacher so i'll literally get to him right at two my, it says 244 because i have it onto my house and so let's try to get there quickly Sorry, I always said I was going to be that parent who was early, who was like the first person in the line. Like, I'm going to drop and make sure I'll be the first person. Um, but every parent is probably trying to do that who's a car rider. Like, I'm going to be the first person to where it's a long line. Hi, JJ. Did he finally get that um, water bottle? Hi, buddy. Thank you. Have a nice day. Mommy. 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 Yes. Daddy and Kinsey. They at the house. I was running behind, but one second, okay? Do at the house. Look at you. Where's that water bottle? I bring it. Very good. We found it. Who had it? That one. Miss Botts? Yeah, Miss Botts. Okay, very good. Fix your hat. I can't see the first grade. Turn it. Turn it a little bit. Yeah, keep turning. Fix it, yeah. Fix it. There we go. Perfect. Oh my good first day of kindergarten. So happy you got that water bottle. So let's put our seatbelt on, okay? Okay. What was your favorite activity today? What's the favorite thing you did? What was fun? I did. I worked outside. Oh, outside time was fun? Yeah. What'd you do? Because, because the, the one friend was hurt himself. He and hurt himself? Yeah, because, mm. because he ran to teacher. Mm. Because he was crying. Oh, oh my hat! Okay. The, um, what did you like about the story today that they that, that she read you? What was, what was the what was the story about? That was a raccoon. A raccoon. A raccoon? Yeah. What that raccoon did? He 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 said he wanted to go to Kuya just like me. Oh, but then he liked it. No, he don't like it because I liked it. No, so you said the story was about the raccoon. Because it was story time. It was story time. Oh, okay. So you like story? Do you like the raccoon story? Yeah, because we, we dance and sing. Really? Yeah. Bell ABC. Was it night? Was it fun? Yeah, it was fun. Then wow. I didn't take naps. No nap today? No, because I only dance. I only do yard stuff. Wow, I thought you took a nap. No naps? No, no naps in my Wow. That's wow, that's amazing. Mommy, mommy, you thought I take naps? Yeah, I thought you took naps. Oh, you're at big kid school. Got it. Mmm. I'm glad you had a good day. And did you eat your how what did you eat? Did you eat your lunch? Mm, no. <gasps> Hi, I know you. Let me move up so I can put your seatbelt on. Mommy, I was just testing you on. Yeah, we were waiting forever. We, JJ was like, what's taking her so long? I said, JJ, I don't know. But she's taking a long time. 
No. No, I'm here. You're here. Say hello to everyone. Hi. Uh -oh. take care of it. I'm going to carry it. I'm going to give it to you. They're going to give it to us on Friday. Well, I'm thirsty. Okay, we're almost home. So, after getting the kids, we went home. And um, it took forever. Okay, I went all the way back, like an area okay, I normally like to shop to get orders and nothing. I was literally driving. I was like, Lord, you have to bless me. You have to help me hit a decent goal, you know? And I was just telling my husband, like, oh, I went all the way, nothing, nothing. And I got phone. I was just talking, and then, like, the Lord blessed me. I got a $40 order um, at Costco. And, um, it was, I did that, and then, no, oh, yeah, I got, the, I got a $40 order, and I was like, first I saw it, was like, it said, I think I saw, for some reason, I think I saw, like, 97, 96, I don't know, oh, my, I said, let me look at it and see exactly what it is. Good thing I took it, it was two stores, but one person, and then the one person lived point three from the second store. Glory to God. Oh, my God, like you wasn't supposed to in um, Kroger, you wouldn't be as thirsty as you are. You Mommy, you, we're not going to run in the puppet. So you're not supposed to be running, period. It's not a park, guys. Mom, Mom. It's not a park. So now I'm going to run into Publix and get some more sub rolls for their sandwiches um, tomorrow. JD doesn't have school Friday, so it's just one for him for tomorrow. Me, and please. then for Kenzie as well. And then we already still have like the lunch meat. Y'all. Grocery list about to extend because making these lunches ain't no joke. And I'll break down my day for you guys. I and I only started at ten o'clock, and God bless me from ten o'clock to my last order was at like five thirty. And I made I did pretty darn good, better than what I what I've been doing, especially with them how they been how they dropped the pay. Every one of my orders were two miles or less. <laughs> It was nobody but God. Nobody. My less, my my lowest order was twenty six. Thank you. You have a nice night, okay? And no, you can trash it. I appreciate it. Oh, thank you. Yours too. No, ma'am. All right, what can I get you? Can I get the two for three sixty nine? Let me get the um, chicken nuggets. Let me get two of those. Sweet and sour sauce. And then let me get um, another two for three for 69. Let me get two double cheeseburgers. Eat cheese. All right, anything else for you? Yeah, let me get a medium fry, no salt. And then that'll be it. Get a medium fry, no salt? Yes, ma'am. All right, anything else for you today? No, no, ma'am. Alright, thanks so much. It's going to be 1131 for Santa, please. Thanks. Mm. The least I can do is get them McDonald's. It was, it was okay, you know. Yes. Now, y'all heard me say medium fry, right? Why well, they charged me for large, which is what I really wanted, but I didn't want to eat the fries, so I got the medium. So now I'm going to have to eat a little bit of the fries. And I forgot to get ketchup while I was at Publix. So guess what I'm about to do? Get a handful of ketchup from here. So they'll have it for the morning if they want eggs. Whole bunch of ketchup. Huh? Yeah, two doubles. Yeah, um, I have a whole bunch of ketchup. It was two doubles. Two, uh, um, <laughs> yeah, four sweet and sour in here. And we yeah, get a little bit more ketchup. Whole bunch of Can I have 100? Perfect. <laughs> Have a good one, all right? Doggy, what are you doing? Yes. Uh, we are here. <laughs> what a puppy would want. Want Ooh. 100 ketchup? Fresh. Ketchup? Fresh out the fryer. Can you yeah. try? Sure. So hot though? But, but I don't. Oh, sit down now, sit down, sit down, get in your chair, put your seatbelt on. Oh. Ah. Ah. Ooh, cake. Oh, uh -huh. <laughs> More water? No, even a little bit. Okay. Mom, here, try some. Mm. Mm. It's, it's cold. Tea drink all day. It's okay. Can I get you some? 
Okay, just a tad bit, Mama. Okay, just a tad bit? Yeah. Okay, I'll give you just a tad bit. Mm-hmm. That's enough? That's good enough. There you go. Thank you so much. Thank you. You did great. All right, go sit down so I can get you your food. Who told him to open my mail? Who told him to open my mail? Since it's open, I'll show you what I got. TikTok always make you like got me buy stuff. So I brought this right here. Natural um, teeth cleaning, natural toothpaste. So, oh, sure, I should have to go to Kroger. I'm starting to know. Before I end the vlog, how I found the video, I wanted to um, share with you how my day went and you see how it went. And like I said, all glory goes to God because of how they're treating how they recently went down on the pay and stuff like that. Um, I didn't start until 10 p.m., 10 a.m. this morning. And my last order was at around like five and then I stopped in between to get the kids. And I did, I made 149 and 60 cents. And I made what the Lord wanted me to make today, what he had for me today. And I would have liked to hit 200, but I want to be home before the sun goes down. Um, I don't want to be out late. Um, if I would have went out this morning, um, this order's coming across now because it's late. You know, people are just getting off of work. But at five o'clock, I want to be home too. You know, so I'm so grateful. It's gonna go into another video. I'm feeling so weary um, recently on how it's been going, but I have to come to terms to know that God is my provider. He is my source. He is my everything. I can't depend on anyone. Um, me and my husband can't depend on anyone. You know, we depend on each other, but with us depending on each other, we solely depend on God. So when I say we can't, we don't depend on anyone, meaning that um, he's our everything. So that's the reason I'm making this video today. I hope it, um, even though I was like kind of nervous, it made me just praise God. Like I literally was just singing and praising God and just saying, thank you Lord for blessing me today and whatever you have for me. And I'm grateful. And we'll see how it goes tomorrow. Um, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like. Um, let me know in the comments um, what you, um, how you depend on God. So I hope this video um, draws you closer to him to know to depend on him, whatever your need is, um, whatever your need of. Know that um, he's got your back. And I have to remember that, like, I know he would never leave, he would never leave me. Like, it was crazy how today went. Like, all my orders were good. Like, none of them, like, were bad. It was, it was pretty good. And we ran into other people who were saying, like, they noticed how bad it was, getting, how bad it's going, because it's so saturated now, guys. Like, so many people are doing stuff on their own. So, all glory goes to God. Like, somewhere in scripture it says, Will the righteous ever be forsaken? No. As long as we're trying to aim for righteousness every day, living the way God has called us to live and to follow in His commandments, He will never leave us astray. And no matter how the economy is, no matter how the job um, shortages or pay or anything like that, we have to remember, including myself, that God is our source. And he has shown me that countless and countless and countless times. Even today, I'm amazed because he showed me yet again, he is my source. And I like no good thing because I'm a child of his. It's so beautiful. And it's one of the many reasons why I love him so much. Because I urge you to trust God every day, every single day.